Hello everybody, welcome back to another technical demos. So in this video, we'll showcase how to implement micro profile application using Hashtag. And this is a part one of a micro profile application technical demo. So my name is Daniel o. I'm working for Red Hat as a technical marketing major. So let's get started with this demo. So first, uh, how to install a micro profile specification on JBoss EAP server. So first, you need to install EAP 7.3.0, and then you're going to patch it, uh, EAP 7.3.1. And then uh, you need to set up uh, EAP extension pack manager to address to uh, EAP patch stream with a micro profile. And then finally, you, need, you just need to patch EAP XP 1.0.0 uh, patch stream. And eventually, you need to run EAP XP uh, 1.0.0. 0.0 server and here is some example how to procedure this uh, installation so if you already run eap 731 on your local machine or production environment you just need to skip uh, the first step and then just go through to the other step so there are uh, eight uh, micro profile component on top of jbus eap 731 and i'm not gonna uh, talk about every single detail but i'm gonna show you today with some demo uh, the configuration and test chat with a micro pro profile uh, specification and capability. So in order to add uh, micro profile health and configuration, uh, you can uh, set it up uh, readiness and health or live news health check and also you can retrieve and get uh, some system environment variable or property file the specific configuration using micro profile config implementation and specification okay uh, this is uh, my uh, sample application for this demo and i'm going to use micro profile quick start uh, this is the tech preview on JBoss EAP 731 XP uh, repository. So here is uh, the health uh, repository here. It's a Maven project and uh, uh, I, I'm going to set it up uh, live in this annotation on this sample application. The simple has to check and uh, the winner expose uh, endpoint and we're going to return the simple has to check return code. And here is uh, database connection uh, uh, endpoint and using a uh, readiness annotation. So this is just simulation database connection, which means so we're gonna uh, uh, retrieve the database configuration with the true and false is sort of the boolean uh, parameter, and then uh, uh, this is this uh, not actual database uh, com uh, communication, but is the simulated database connection. So. If you, uh, the, the variable, I mean the Boolean uh, database configuration is true, so we're going to return uh, database is health is uh, uh, the true. So uh, just to re uh, deploy uh, this application to on running on JBoss EAP server, this is my local machine. I already installed JBoss EAP 731 with the micro profile XP. So now you can see uh, the new wall file is already deployed with the Maven. Uh, deploy with the micro profile deploy plugin and let's try to access the uh, the liveness uh, endpoint we, we gotta see the simple has check return code and let's try to uh, readiness endpoint here and go to health and ready and uh, now you gotta see the has check is the status is up let's try to change the uh, configuration like a false and redeploy this application onto running JBoss EAP and go to access the endpoint. Once again, the connection is a fail. So, but this is not reality uh, enterprise environment. So let's try to add uh, Postgres uh, communication and connection just like an uh, enterprise reality. So I'm gonna uh, uh, define uh, two uh, variable, the first in a DDB pole. So the reason why I put in the system environment because uh, when you deploy this application on OpenShift or Kubernetes cluster, uh, you can retrieve the Postgres port and host variable from system environment, and then you can report that variable from your pod. Okay, so the default name and local host and the default port is a 54 story two, and I'm gonna uh, define another method 
uh, to communicate the actual database using DB host variable and port number and using the socket uh, class. I'm going to create a new socket using the DB port and the port name just so I define an above uh, the class. So I'm going to command on the existing simulate method and create the ping server and change the real uh, parameter. So let's try redeploy this application running on, on top of JBoss EAP and then just try to access endpoint ready. Once again, now you got to so change the real database connection because I already run the Docker container on my local machine in PostgreSQL. Let's try to kill the container and then try to access the endpoint to check readiness and now you got a connection refused and which means the, the readiness is a fail. So I'm going to rerun my container uh, to run post, uh, PostgreSQL and I'll try to access readiness check once again. Now the database is back on track. So this is the beauty of a micro profile capability for has check specification. You can also uh, get uh, readiness and liveness at the same time. In order to uh, implement this functionality on your Maven project, you can add a uh, health API micro profile and configure uh, API micro profile uh, specification in your Palmx ML. So thank you for watching and please make sure uh, to subscribe to the next valuable practical video and uh, thanks for watching again and have a good rest of the day.